compassionate appointment under central government. Disclaimer, this training material is for use and training of officials. It should not be referred as guideline of government. In case of any variance in this training material, the government guidelines, rules, law shall prevail. In this video, we will learn about compassionate appointment. Compassionate appointment is a social security scheme launched by the government of India to grant appointment to a dependent family member on a compassionate basis when a government servant dies while in service or retires on medical grounds. The objective is to provide immediate financial assistance to the family who is left in poverty and without any means to sustain their livelihood. Government servant means a person appointed on a regular basis in a government establishment and not a daily wage worker or a casual apprentice or a worker on contractual basis. Dependent family member means spouse, whether husband or wife, son, including adopted son, daughter, including adopted daughter, brother or sister, in the case of unmarried government servant, or member of the armed forces as referred in the next slides. Compassionate appointment is given in case a government servant who dies while in service, including death by suicide, or is retired on medical grounds under the Rule 2 of Center Civil Services Medical Examination Rules 1957 or the corresponding provisions in the Center Civil Services Regulations before attaining the age of 55 years, 57 years for as per Group D government servants, or is retired on medical grounds under the Rule 38 of the Center Civil Services Pension Rules 1972 or the corresponding provisions in the Center Civil Services Regulations before attaining the age of 55 years, 57 years for as well Group D government servants. Rule 2 of the Center Civil Services Medical Examination Rule 1957 says, if a government servant is suffering from a contagious disease or a physical or mental disability that interferes with the efficient discharge of his duties, then the authority may direct the concerned government employee to undergo a medical examination and on the basis of medical recommendations, government can dismiss the concerned person. Rule 38 of the Center Civil Services Pension Rules in 1972 is about invalid pension. It says, government servant retires or retired from the service on account of any bodily or mental infirmity which permanently incapacitates him from the service. The facility of compassionate appointment is also for the armed forces. A member of the armed force who dies during the service or is killed in action or is medically boarded out and is unfit for civil employment. Compassionate appointment in case of married daughter. She can be considered for the appointment subject to conditions that she was wholly dependent on the government servant at the time of his or her death in harness or retirement on medical grounds. She must support other dependent members of the family. Compassionate appointment in case of married brother. A married brother is not considered dependent on a government servant. Competent authority to make compassionate appointment is Joint Secretary in charge of administration in the Ministry or Department concern. Head of the department under the Supplementary Rule 210 in the case of attached and subordinate offices. Secretary in the Ministry or Department concern in a special type of cases. Post to which appointment can be made? Group C post against the direct recruitment quota. Eligibility. The family is impecunious and deserves prompt financial support. Dependent family members applying for compassionate appointment should be eligible and suitable for the post under the relevant recruitment rules. Exemptions Recruitment procedure that is, without the agency of the Staff Selection Commission or the Employment Exchange. Clearance from the surplus sale of the Department of Personal and Training or Directorate General of Employment and Training. 
the ban orders on filling up the post issued by the Ministry of Finance. Relaxations Upper age limit could be relaxed wherever found to be necessary. The lower age limit should in no case be relaxed below 18 years of age. Age eligibility shall be determined with reference to the date of application and not with the date of appointment. In exceptional circumstances, government may consider recruiting persons not immediately meeting the minimum education standards. Government may engage them as a trainees who will be given a regular pay bands only on acquiring the minimum qualification prescribed under the recruitment rules. Can be given exemption from the requirement of passing the typing test to the post of LDC. In case of appointment of a widow not fulfilling the requirement of education qualification against the post of multitasking staff, she will be placed in the pay level 1, provided the appointing authority is satisfied that the duties of the post against which she is being appointed can be performed. Time limit for considering applications. There is no time limit and decision taken on merit in each cases. Ability request for compassionate appointment. Applications to be considered. The decision may be taken only at the level of the secretary of the department or ministry concerned. The application to be decided with the reference to the date of death or retirement on medical grounds of a government servant and not the age of the applicant at the time of consideration. Widow appointed on compassionate grounds getting remarried will be allowed to continue in service even after remarriage. In case where there is a earning member, a dependent family member may be considered for the compassionate appointment with prior approval of the secretary of the department or ministry concerned. If already in employment and is not supporting family, extreme caution has to be observed in ascertaining the economic distress of the family of the government servant so that the facility of appointment on compassionate ground is not misused. In case of missing government servant, compassionate appointment can be considered only after a lapse of at least two years from the date from which the government servant has been missing, provided that an FIR to this effect has been lodged with the police. The missing person is not traceable and the competent authority feels that the case is genuine. This benefit will not be applicable to the case of a government servant who had less than two years to retire on the date from which he has been missing or who is suspected to have committed fraud or suspected to have joined any terrorist organization or suspected to have gone abroad. While considering such a request, the results of the police investigation should also be taken into account and a decision on any such request for compassionate appointment should be taken only at the level of the secretary of the ministry or department concern. Procedure Applications to be given in prescribed format. The welfare officer in each ministry or department or office should meet the family members of the family and assist them in getting appointment on compassionate grounds. The applicant should be called in person at the very first stage and advise in person about the requirements and formalities to be completed by him. Undertaking for maintenance of the family A person appointed on compassionate grounds under the scheme should give an undertaking in writing that he or she will maintain properly the other family members who were dependent on the government servant. A request for change of post or person. Any request should be rejected. Seniority. The appointed person may be placed at the bottom of all the candidates recruited appointed through direct recruitment or promotion etc. in that year, irrespective of the date of joining of the candidate on compassionate ground. Termination of service. 
can be terminated on the grant of non-compliance of any condition stated in the offer of appointment after issue of show cause notice and it is not necessary to follow the procedure prescribed in the disciplinary rules or temporary service rules for this purpose. This power of termination of services is vested on the secretary in the concerned administrative ministry or department. The persons appointed to the post do have the essential educational and technical qualifications and experience required for the post. A family member of a such as were Group D government employee can be appointed to a Group C post for which he or she is educationally qualified, provided a vacancy in Group C post exists for this purpose. Applicability of Reservation Rooster a person selected for appointment on compassionate grounds should be adjusted in the recruitment roster against the appropriate category that is SC, ST, OBC general depending upon the category to which he belongs. The application format part A is shown on the screen. The declaration on undertaking is shown on the screen. In this video, we have learned about compassionate appointment. If you have any doubt or want any clarification, then you can contact through the mail as shown on the screen. For other videos and rules and regulations, you can visit the web address as shown. Thank you.